Greetings subscribers and other curious persons. Today I've mostly been working on expanding a throwaway bit of backstory that one of my characters refers to in a novel into a fully fleshed out chapter. And one of the problems I've hit is that it's set during the Crusades when obviously there weren't watches and clocks. So whilst I'd done my basic research on the area and so on, every time I wanted to transition between events, I hit the problem that I couldn't really say a couple of minutes or half an hour because the time didn't really seem that accurate. So I've spent a lot of time starting paragraphs with a short while later so that I can go back in the rewrite and put in varied time periods that are more suitable to the time it's set. So obviously, you know, it's a, it never seemed, the research never quite seems enough. So uh, at some point I'm going to have to call an end on it before it turns into a giant book on the Crusades. So uh, if you are reading my stuff and you are an avid, avid lover of the history of the Crusades, then unfortunately I might have to disappoint you in that there may be the occasional little inaccuracy that's in there for plot purposes to save me having to put in lots of detail that won't necessarily be of interest to everyone. But uh, that's it for work. In other news, my wife was slightly chilly last night because the temperature has dropped quite sharply around here. So we got the spare duvet out of the wardrobe and she left it on the wall chair overnight. And Mr. Jasper has decided that a soft thing on top of a soft thing is clearly designed to be his bed. So in favour of all of the cat beds we have set up, he has now claimed the large pile of duvet. Well, toodaloo.